Hey everyone, it's Suzanne. I'm back with another video and this video is my haul that I picked up from PPU in May 2024. The theme was it came from outer space and I wind up picking up three beautiful polishes from that haul. But before we get into that, let me show you what is on my nails currently. So I actually have two different polishes on. So the first, this blue one here is from Kathleen and Co. Where is it at? There we go. And it is called Dip Into the Pool. And it's just basically, um, I think it was like a, some type of summer cream she released. It's just like a really just beautiful, beautiful blue polish. And then on all my other fingers, I have this polish from Sally Hansen. And this is Peeps Cotton Candy. And it's just a really pretty pink and it's got um blue glitters in it that i think perfectly match up the kathleen and co it's kind of like textured or something it's got some type of like white sparkle in there too but that is currently what is on my nails so again these are in no particular order but they're all beautiful i'm super excited um to look at these polishes so the first one that i wound up picking up is by danny vienna and this is milky stars and this is described as a sheer Crelly white base with black irregular glitters and many black and gray stars. And it is inspired by Star Art Resin. I just remembered, I kept thinking I could dupe this. And I know a lot of people were probably like, that polish is dupable, which it probably is. But it just was so cute the way it did like a little pond effect. I couldn't get over it. So I was like, I have to have that one. I don't care. I love stars. Um... And I love little star glitters and polishes, so I was like, I'm a sucker. I have not shaken this or done anything to manipulate it, so I don't know what we're going to get. But in the first coat, we did get, is that two, yeah, it's two stars right there together. Um, but it's hard to see the polish because I'm on a white swatch wheel again, as I always say. But you can already see how it's kind of like developed like a little pond effect with those two stars because they have that white um, overneath them. I do think this is a polish that like I didn't get any stars on this one. You would have to, I'm going to move this star with my brush kind of to make it like a little bit better looking. Um, manipulate if you want great star placement. But I mean, I'm happy with the two stars I got in... Um, you know, two coats without trying. Like when I wear this, I might, I don't know. I, I say I might try a little bit more, but I probably honestly won't. But I just thought it was super cute, super fun. Yeah, could you dupe it? Yeah, you probably could. But I don't know. I just couldn't stop thinking about it. When I looked at my wish list, it never got vetoed off. So I was like, I have to have that one. So this is da by Danny Vienna. And this is Milky Stars. Really cute polish. And then next up, I am not going to be able to say this one. This is Noodles Nail Polish. And this is Zetus Laptus. Laptus? I'm not sure how you say that. But this is a blue crelly with sapphire, raspberry, pink, and purple glitters and hollow flakes. And is inspired by Xena, girl of the 21st century. I didn't watch that. So I don't know. I don't know what it is. But... I just, I remember the swatch pictures of this were just so cute. I was just like, oh, it's a cutie. It is a cutie. So I was like, I have to have that one. So, and I love noodles. Um, if you like glitter polishes, noodles is a brand you need to look into because her glitter polishes are just so cute, so fun. There it is in one coat. I mean, look at the amount of glitters you get out without shaking the bottle, without manipulating, without fishing, just, just amazing, really. So we're going to put a second coat right on top of it, and that is just going to, you know, just make this baby pop full of glitters. Like, look at that, just chunk full of glitters. I just thought, again, like I said, I thought when I saw this polish, I thought, oh, it is a cutie. And again, it just never left my wish list when I was whittling down. So it had to come home with me. Beautiful, beautiful polish. Really fun. So again, this is Noodles Nail Polish. Zetus. Lapteus. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about that one. I'm sure I'm not pronouncing it right. 
Okay, next up I have the last one that I picked up is from Rogue Lacquer, and this is Moonstone. This, look at that, look at that glow, that blue glow. This, oh, yeah, pur blue purple glow is what it says. So it, this is described as a creamy grayish base with a strong blue purple slowly shifting shimmer. So I guess what she means is that it will go from blue to purple slowly. I am kind of seeing that purple in certain turnings of the bottle. But look at that. This was inspired by Moon Rock and the Moonstone Actual Gemstone. I don't know a lot about that either. But I just remembered this being so glowy and so pretty um, that I was like, oh, I have to have that one. Like I said, this one, it was another polish, just would never, oh my gosh, it's so glowy. This is another polish that just never got whittled off um, my wish list. Oh, that is a stunner. That is a stunner. This is going to be so fun, so pretty on the nails. I cannot wait to wear this. This is just going to be a bunch of glowy goodness. Oh my gosh that is beautiful that shimmer Whew. that's a good one right there oh my gosh i cannot wait to get that one on my nails so this is rogue lacquer moonstone so those are the three i picked up from polish pickup in may if you picked anything up for may let me know what you got because i would love to see which ones you know, struck your fancy and which ones you were like, oh, I have to have, um, cause polish pickup is always so hard to narrow it down, but I would love to see which ones you all picked up. If you like these type of videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. I do nail content all the time and I also do monthly giveaways of nail polish to subscribers. I hope everyone has a great day. Remember, keep polishing. Bye.